Good evening all. Let's learn about obesity hypoventilation syndrome today. Obesity hypoventilation syndrome abbreviated as OHS also known as Pickwickian syndrome. So let's see in detail. It is defined as obesity BMI more than 30 kilos per meter square and hypoventilation with daytime hypercapnia. Daytime hypercapnia when measured in PCO2 when measured with ABG PCO2 more than 45 mm of Hg in the absence of other features of hypoventilation like severe obstructive or restrictive lung disease, uh, severe ILD, interstitial lung disease, any other causes of hypoxia like severe hypothyroidism, neuromuscular diseases and any other uh, usage of narcotics, all such, such types of hypoventilation, causes of hypoventilation should be ruled out. And these, these are the formal diagnostic criteria, BMI more than 30, data hypercapnia, PCO2 more than 45 with absence of other causes of hypoventilation. So from this formal diagnostic criteria, OHS should be regarded as the diagnosis of exclusion. And notably, 90% of patients with obesity hypoventilation syndrome have estimated to have OSC. OSC means obstructive sleep apnea. And the presence of OSC is not necessary for the diagnosis of obesity hypoventilation syndrome. The most effective treatment for obesity hypoventilation syndrome will be weight loss. Approximately 25 to 30 percent of weight loss is required for obesity hypoventilation syndrome symptoms to reduce. And the other first line of treatment will be CPAP, positive airway pressure ventilation. Mostly we give nocturnal continuous positive airway pressure, CPAP machine. So this is the brief about obesity hypoventilation syndrome. Thank you.